get started. Okay. So, would you like to introduce yourself? Yes, hi. My name is Elena Shimming. I'm the designer and founder for Colleen Jewelry. Um, so, can you explain some of the jewelry that we're looking at right now, such as this piece right here? Oh, this piece is wonderful. It is handmade. It is all natural stone. So let me just pick it up and show you. It's a bib necklace and it's backed on with felt. Um, it's citrine, carnelian, green onyx, turquoise, amethyst, and seed beads. And so you would wear it, I guess with anything. You could put it on today. Little black dress, little white tank. It is amazing. It's the only one I have like this because it's so time consuming to make. <laughs> and how much does that piece would run for? This is our most expensive piece and it is 200 Okay. Now, I noticed that some of your pieces are connected to the artworks that you have. Would yes. you like to explain those connections? Well, I really wanted to take the opportunity to make this um, event more like a pop-up store and to me if you can have a retail location you decorate it and it looks very cohesive and it explains the jewelry throughout so I took pictures of the pieces before I came and had them printed so I tweaked them in Photoshop exaggerated them, blurred them, colorized them and then mounted them on foam core and had this gold foil tape that I put around the edges and mounted them on the walls do you usually get your vision from your artwork to create a, a piece? No, it's, it kind of is, goes both ways. So there's not necessarily one that influences the other. It's just whatever I guess has a, have a need for at the moment. If I want to make a piece of artwork or a piece of jewelry, then it usually turns into both at some point. So not one piece actually speaks to you more? The no. jewelry or the art? <laughs> Well, the jewelry I do nine like nine to five or you know all the time, twenty four seven, um, because I love it so much. And the art is more of a hobby. Okay. Okay. So I'm just gonna show oops, a couple of the work. And would all of your pieces go into the same ball range of the the big necklace that you showed us earlier? I'm sorry? The price, would the price... Oh, no. They, that, that one's really set apart from everything else. So I try to okay. keep everything under $100. Okay. Just because I think that fashion accessories are of the moment. You want to be able to pick up and purchase and wear and not have to think too much about it. They're supposed to be fun and a table. Thank you very much for your time. Sure thing. Thank you. Have a good day. You too.